hey you guys it's sunshine vibes with the high vibrations if you are new to my channel thank you for watching if you are returning thank you for subscribing to your girl love and light to you all i hope everybody is doing good so yeah you guys as you can see i'm outside today it feels good outside um i was doing some yoga outside today and i just started crying i haven't cried in a while um so I feel like I had a lot of emotional tension that I needed to release. Some of you all could have some emotional, excuse my hands, they kind of dry. Some of you all could have some emotional tension you need to release. Yoga helps with releasing uh, negative emotions, okay? Um, don't hold it in. Uh, it's time to let that stuff out, okay? We have to let release and let that stuff go. Um, some of you all could be being guided to go outside and meditate as well. I feel so much clarity around me right now, okay? Make sure you all, you guys are entering your vortex. And when I say entering your vortex, I'm literally just saying protect your energy, okay? One, 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 as I say this, protect your energy. Um, when you enter your vortex, you are literally putting yourself in a protection bubble. Um, with this being said, the birds is talking nature is talking okay nature is talking right now i feel so free you guys make sure you just stay connected right stay connected um i had a download my kids actually told me this so like last weekend we went to the park and i meditated did some yoga and i hugged this tree this just used to be like one of my favorite spots to come meditate at right and I hugged the tree because I really miss being here, you know. Um, and my daughter's is like, why are you hugging the tree? So my oldest daughter, she went to school today and she texted me while she was at school. She said, Mama, we watching Pocahontas. And she was talking to the tree and the tree told her she knew her path. She knew her, she knew her path and she knew that, you know, about the spirit world she knows that you know she's a spiritual being and two 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 as i say this it gave me the confirmation that i needed when it comes to enlightenment um sometimes we can't explain things okay in a certain way and even with having kids like you know we take different paths than the way we was raised and it's kind of hard to kind of explain things but it's like you would know if you're on the right path if you get confirmation through your kids. Um, everybody knows that if you have kids, okay, they serve a purpose. And I feel like, me personally, our children are supposed to help us figure out our purposes in life because they have a purpose. And their purpose here is to literally help us bring out what is inside of us, okay? Literally, some people say, okay, you have a kids, that means how many lessons you you haven't learned. How many, uh, however many kids that you have is how many lessons that you had to learn, okay? And this could be true, okay? Who really knows, you know? But I just feel so good. I'm being called to speak on this because understand that when you have children, we have to teach our kids the right way. And it's kind of hard when sometimes we don't know you know I'm, don't get me wrong sometimes we don't know this is why meditation is so important meditation and prayer is so important okay i'm being called to to talk about this because a lot of people think that spirituality is just you know love and light and it's not sometimes you got to walk in the unknown you have to kind of look at life in a different light you know um and it's hard for some people to walk in that walk. It's hard for some people to walk in that direction of the unknown. If you get what I'm saying, especially when you're used to knowing life as a certain way. Am I saying it right? <laughs> okay, Spirit. Talk to me. 434. Okay, be the leader that you want it, right? So if you, you're you used to going a certain way because other people went this way, 444, as I say this, you are the creator of your reality. So you have the power within yourself to create whatever reality that you want on the outside, okay? 
So this is why it's important to enter your vortex because happiness and peace is from within. Nobody can take that from you. Um, protect your energy by all means, you guys. Protect your energy by all means. Also, people think you crazy because you talk to trees. Like, where, the, where do they think we get oxygen from? Like, the trees, they supply every need, okay? This is literally the tree of life, okay? I don't know if a lot of people have heard of this story, the story of the tree of life. You might want to look it up, but you guys, dive deep, okay? It's time to dive deep. Um, also... It's been really heavy on my heart to say this. Stop comparing your life to someone else's. Okay? Because I feel like God's been putting this on my heart. Five, 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 as I say this. Stop comparing your life to someone else's. Like I said, happiness and peace comes from within. So if you are searching answers, okay, meditation brings answers. Uh, a lot of people say, I don't know how to meditate. I don't know how to meditate. I actually, when I first started meditating outside, uh, some dude was walking the uh, trail and he stopped and he said, that's right, queen. That's right, goddess. And he said, I see you meditating. He said, you know, us black people meditate naturally. And uh, this is true. So there is, I feel like there is no right or wrong way. Uh, I feel like as you grow spiritually, you know, you learn to, you just learn different ways of being and different ways of living. So, you know, how someone else meditate, you know, maybe they're not at that level, you know what I'm saying, of spirituality yet. And then it, it takes time, you know, but you guys just make sure you're staying connected you know what i'm saying and do the things that make you feel good okay don't do things because you see someone else doing them or you feel like this is a a way to do things do things for yourself okay do things that are good for your health that is going to benefit your overall health so my kids even kept telling me mama why don't you start meditate why don't you start doing your readings outside I used to do readings outside all the time, right? So it, it was really because of the weather and stuff like that. So I'm, I'm just going to get back into doing it because it's like Spirit's been talking to me through my kids and I've just been loving it, okay? ba da ba 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 I'm loving it. <laughs> I'm loving life right now. Um, Even with the trials and tribulations, understand that I know that this world is not mine, <laughs> right? This world is being controlled by a higher force, a higher power. And I release the need to know all the answers. I release the need to control my life. I know that I have to let go of the things that I cannot control. You guys, this is so important. Just and, and, and listen, okay? Listen to nature. Okay, spirit guys, angels, ancestors, give me clear messages for my collective. What do they need to know at this time? Let's see what messages that I have for you all today. This card is not supposed to be in here. We have wrong use of power, dark red, which it's been coming out a lot. So, again... Do things your way. I wish y'all could see this bird. This bird is like just standing. It's like three birds just standing here, like looking up. They look like an army. So I feel like you have an army rising up for you, right? You have an army that is rising up for you. 9-11, as I had said this, this is literally because you are going through um, an ascension process. Ascension? Ascension? <laughs> ascension process. <sighs> You need to up your protection. So if you are not praying daily, meditating daily, you have to up your protection. Especially when you are when you are leveling up spiritually. Okay, it is definitely levels to this shit. Okay, it's levels to this shit. Give me more. Stealing money. So this person could be doing something very dark and behind the scenes. This person is stealing. Okay, this is a thief. 
you're dealing with a thief you're dealing with a, a criminal you're dealing with somebody who is um not of the light okay this person is not of the light like i said walking through the unknown is just so much different when you are like actually trying to find solutions through the unknown i feel like people get this kind of mixed up like it ain't all love and light but when you walk through the unknown if you're not walking through to find solutions you're you're actually in the unknown and you you want to be stuck you know what i'm saying some people don't want to be free some people literally just want to be stuck it goes back to you know the thief comes to steal kill and destroy because this person it doesn't want to live an abundant life this is the type of person that feels like you know that's the only way they gotta get ahead that's the only way they can get ahead a lot of people out here in the world feel like that they have to beat scam uh they have to do things to get ahead in life and and you and you don't you know i mean it's a quick and easy way to get up in life this person likes to get up in life the quick and easy way this goes back to when i said um it's probably why I was channeling quit looking at everybody's life and thinking that it's all peaches and cream because you don't know what that person has to go through okay their situation might be totally different than yours so like it's it's almost like somebody needs to learn that they have to do the work whoever this dark which is they have to do the work and this is even could be healing with when it comes to healing if this person is a dark witch, maybe this person is not healing from the things that they went through. And maybe you are, okay? Maybe you are healing. And <laughs> this is why you could be ranking up or leveling up is because you are actually doing the work. And this is, like I said, inner work. A lot of people think, you know, we just got to go get a job and just work a job and wake up every day and not want to go to work and not be happy. That is not my portion <laughs> okay okay affirm that is not your portion okay that is not your portion collective clarify still the money seven of pentacles this person is really just worried about money like this person is really just worried about the material world this person could be very materialistic everybody is being set up so stay out of it so whatever is going on, this could be multiple people, okay? I'm getting like in um, a group. So this could be a friends group, a family group. But this is a group of people. And I feel like Spirit just wants you to stay out of it. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, mind your business, okay? Like, I feel like that's what you've been doing, minding your business. But these people have been doing something that is very 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 dark you know it's, it's not of the light i'm just not getting a good energy from this um somebody thought you was gonna help them oh wait we got family so this is definitely a family your family members wow it'd be your own family y'all i'm sorry because I, I I pick up on a lot of these messages. It's a yellow butterfly. Somebody let me know what yellow butterflies mean spiritually. Um, I pick up on a lot of messages. And some of them are just like, you know, it'd be like, you need to know, you need to know certain things, okay? When it comes to your life and the people you surround yourself with. Like I said, entering your vortex, protecting your energy is so important. Um, I've seen a post. I'm actually going to make this my thumbnail. It was a post that said, I don't think I'm better than anyone. You know, I just don't want certain people in my energy. You know what I'm saying? And that's just, and that's fine. We have to realize like at a certain point, at a certain point in your life, like we have to find ourselves, you know, it's so easy to get lost out here. And I feel like you're just dealing with a lot of lost people, a lot of lost souls, you know, people that, you know, know they have a purpose but instead of trying to seek a higher purpose these people are trying to find a way to come up quick i'm getting i'm hearing come up quick come up screen schemes these are scammers and thieves and and liars could even be killers i just heard but you are healing 1444 as i say this you are healing so continue to enter your vortex and continue to heal yourself okay 
Oh, wait, we got 144,000, y'all. Come through, spread. Mm, 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 mm. Maybe my kids is right. You see what I'm saying? That's another thing. Like, growing up, being a kid, I couldn't really voice my opinion because I felt like it didn't matter. As Now that I'm an adult, I realize that our children's voice matters. You know, we have to learn to teach our kids to speak up for yourself. Um and listen to your kids because sometimes they can tell you stuff about yourself that you didn't even really know you know they can confirm things for you we have invested something else because nothing will come out of this so somebody just invested in the wrong things or maybe you're being called to invest in something else clarify divine masculine so I could be talking to a divine masculine. Maybe you're investing in something here. Yeah, whoever you are, whoever this divine masculine is, could lack some type of knowledge. Like I said, um, it's okay, you know. It's okay. But somebody's confused on the path. They really don't understand. It's like they don't understand. 11-11. <laughs> they don't understand something. Maybe this person doesn't understand where you get your knowledge from. But like I said, spend time outdoors because nature is knowledge. Like uh, when I first started, I journaled a lot. And I learned that a lot of nature has to do with life. Like nature is life. Like a lot of the animals, the trees, the weather, everything has sir, has a purpose. It's like two days ago, it was so windy outside. It, it literally, I heard the wind. The wind was literally whistling, and all I could think was divine intervention. You know, it is divine intervention going on because a lot of people has been in some type of energy where they've been taken from people. And this is even your energy, your time, like, a lot of people has been taking your energy and this ain't right. You know what I'm saying? It's not right. So this could keep you in a confused energy. Clarify conf confused on the path. Land bricks to build. Yeah, so if I'm talking to a masculine and you're kind of confused, you like you lacking a little knowledge when it comes to your path. Like I said, meditation and prayer brings answers. But Spirit wants you to know your land bricks to build. But you need to meditate and ask God for a higher purpose because there's something that you're investing in that is like, I don't feel like it's worth it anymore. Yeah, numb to the bullshit. Because you already, it's like you feel uh, like I'm just getting some energy. Yeah, you're protected from evil and jealous spirits. I feel like you just numb to the bullshit. This could even be why you're so confused you know maybe you have people that are stealing money from you and you don't even know okay or this is just in general yeah like i said you're very confused you're very stressed out here spend time outdoors because i feel like somebody wants you to be like in a mental prison with mental abuse here yeah watch out So somebody is really trying to start something with you at this time. Yeah, your intuition is telling you that there is some type of prophecy that needs to be fulfilled. Okay, 333. This is why Spirit wants you to understand that if you're confused, you know, meditate. Because you're laying bricks to build and you could feel stressed out. But this is because you have people working behind the scenes in your family here. Clarify this energy. What else for the collective? Communication. Like I said, you guys have to... It's something about communicating with the divine. Okay? It's something about communicating and preparing. I just said this in the reading the other day. It's just, I've been picking up on a lot of masculine energy. So a lot of masculines are waking up. Um, prepare. Pray for the... Prepare for the best, pray for the worst. I mean, prepare for the best, pray for the worst. Well, so these people are literally praying on your downfall. So prepare yourself, right? 
But prepare for the worst and pray for the best. Honoring the past. Yeah, it definitely has to do with some type of past karma. Okay, these people are about to get karma here. These people from your past are about to get karma. I feel like this is because you honored these people. You could have put these people on a pedestal. But Spurs said, it's time for personal alchemy. It's time for you to take a journey with self. Okay? To figure out 2024. To figure out who you are. And that is this year. So, this is you guys, your year of personal alchemy. Okay? Spirit wants to work with you. Okay? God wants to work with you. Make things happen for you. I can't make this up. Thank you for the confirmation, Spirit. Prosperity. Okay? You could be, somebody could be pregnant. Okay? But there is prosperity here for you. There is prosperity here for you. Somebody is getting karma. Meanwhile, you're in a relaxed energy. Yeah, purification. You're, pur you're, you're purifying your energy. Like I said, spend time outdoors to clear some of the cloudy judgment. Because sometimes we mix up cloudy judgment with intuition. Yeah, intuition. I can't make this up. So it's hard to kind of... It's hard to kind of to listen when you are listening to other people. So 2121, you have a lot of cloudy judgment versus your intuition, right? So this is how you are going to um, use your discernment, okay? Even with these messages, use your discernment. Put, put it where it fits. If it don't fit, okay, just leave it. Yeah, relaxed energy. I feel like your prosperity is going to come when you transform her and organize your mind. Let's see what the ancestors got for you guys. But somebody is getting karma, so you don't have to worry about these people, okay? Yeah, we have to take care of yourself. A time for spirit. I can't make this up. Your ancestors want you to take care of yourself and understand it's a time for spirit. So, it's time to get your mind, body, soul together, baby. You can't keep on investing in something that ain't you ain't getting nothing out of it. A wonderful, aha, a wonderful idea, the aha moment. So, yeah, like I said, you can have an idea. You can have an idea, okay, that you want to bring into fruitation. Something is about to end for now. Something you thought finished bust back into your life. So, you thought something was over. It ain't over. <laughs> I just heard it ain't over. So your answer said it ain't over. Yeah, because you miss someone. So do you miss someone, masculine? You miss somebody? Okay. So you miss somebody here. Yeah, you feel like this love is strange. <laughs> you feel like this love is kind of strange because it's like a new world being born. Okay. Give me one more. Oh, wow. The Akashic libraries are open. So, yeah, somebody is definitely tapped in, okay? You definitely tapped in right now. Um, this is why I feel like you could be confused because you're receiving so much guidance. And I feel like you're not able to discern it because you're not actually focused on spirit. You know what I'm saying? You could be focused on laying bricks to build somewhere and spirit is like man it's time for something else we got something else for you okay your ancestors is literally like we got something else for you your akashic libraries is open so start meditating outside give me one more okay so you can find out your life purpose yeah you must choose so choose you have a choice okay you have a choice you can even either, either be a victim of this criminal act that's going on behind the scenes and keep investing in something that's not going to work out because you got people behind the scenes that are like literally being set up and you're being called to stay out of it because these people are trying to confuse you anyway okay so you are not a victim give me one more why is you must choose ancestors yeah he white counsel and listen i'm telling you it's sometimes like i said even children can teach us something. Just make sure you're being true to yourself. And what did I say? Meditation brings answers. Things could be like, you could be going through the storm, but sea storm, calm in the storm. So you're being called to be calm through this storm because endless regret, obsessive grief, replaying the past, negative nostalgia. 
nostalgic. So somebody wants to keep you in um, a state of mind from the past. But spirit wants you to be true to yourself. Yeah, because change is natural and good. And yes, it can hurt. So yeah, you can be hurting right now. You can be stressed out. You can be going through bodily changes because i feel like you guys are like going through a major transformation so you could be going through a lot of changes right now but change is good i was just saying this earlier today like sometimes i feel people think that everything is just everything and it is when you believe that 25 25 this goes back to manifesting because i can't stay stuck on a negative emotion or something that i can't control it's really not in my control so why stress about it you know it might seem like I don't care, but I, I care. It's just like, you got to understand when you are connecting with the universe and you are actually releasing things, the universe will, if you're aligned, you will be pushed out of your comfort zone. Like if you sit on an idea or something too long, you will be pushed into that manifestation. You literally manifest out of a pure heart space so if you are if you have pure intentions this is why a lot of people like i said they want the quick easy way like somebody could have just want an, an easy way out an easy way to the top and it's not no easy way some of us gotta take the damn steps you feel me like you gotta take the steps that's necessary for you for your journey for your path right and we take these steps and it's like man every time i take a step Either I get pushed back or I get pushed forward. And even when we get pushed forward, man, it's hard. Because it's like, dang, I was just doing this. And now I'm already doing this. So, so, so some people, it could, be, it could feel like you doing something wrong. You, you stealing. You doing something. You getting some money some type of way. But in our reality, you're just being called. Okay? And you can't help but to answer the call because... When you are being called, I'm telling you, things is just going to happen. You're going to be like, damn, I was trying to, no, this is not where we, we want you here. So the universe is going to put you there, okay? I'm a firm believer. You cannot have no money or anything. Even when you start a business, people, I want to, I need a, I need this much money. You got to do it, baby. You can't just wait and wait, wait. You just got to do it. And if it don't work out, you tried, period. Okay, give me more chill day yeah so take you a day and chill out okay take some time to yourself go meditate you know yeah new business man new business deals i'm telling y'all take this leap of faith on yourself do something new okay so you can get out of this energy yeah so you can be free i possess the power and the free will to create my own happiness humor i choose to focus on the lighter side of life so you can be free and you can be in an energy where you know you're actually enjoying work you know what i'm saying Give me more. I can't make this up. We have courage. I found the inner strength to face fear with confidence. You need inner strength, baby. You need inner strength. And, and this comes from within. Happiness comes from within. Not this. Not this. It comes from within. Right? This is just a place of peace now. This is like a place of peace. This is a sanctuary right now. Okay? But when it comes to your happiness and your peace, your inner strength, it's come from within. Happiness. I am aware that I, being happy means that I am on the right path. So you guys will know you're on the right path when you're happy. Yeah, love. What did I say? And love is the highest form of vibration. Now, this is where it gets tricky because people like to hate a lot. Yeah. Woo. And I, 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 I know how it is but being around people that are haters. Okay? But they feel to realize you need that negative energy just to motivate you and push you. So these haters are motivators, okay? But when you work out of a love space, I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all, all things. This is how you manifest because you surrender. I can release the need to control. You release the need to control, and that's your judgment. So don't doubt yourself or blame yourself, okay? When it comes to your abundance, just trust, okay? Trust your path, even when sometimes you could feel like you're failing, okay? I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. Yeah, you got to learn from your mistakes. That's why I said, yeah, death, it's something's over. I am learning the end is our nearly beginning. So this is the beginning of your abundance, okay? I am a limitless being, and I can manifest whatever I desire in this physical reality. And you could have a friend that's helping you do this. Yeah, helping you find figure out your purpose. This is what people are for. Anything else before I close this out? Yeah, have fun, collective. 
Find something you love to do. Do something fun, okay? Quit being so serious all the time, all right? Anything else? Yeah, love. I'm telling you. Do something Do something that you love, okay? Do something that's for you, not for everybody else. Do what makes you happy, okay? That's all I got for y'all. Love and light. Namaste. I'll show you.